Hey, how's it going guys? It's been a while. This time got another new update. Well, for today's video, I'm just going to talk about one of these new features on the PCR system, which is quite important, the advanced settings for your IVR. About the IVR, as we know, that's nothing special, right? Usually we will just set up the IVR for a company. So you make a phone call, absolutely you're going to go through the IVR. But one thing left here is, we're not going to be able to set a couple of conditions on the IVR. What if this is out of the business hour? That might be a problem. Or what if you're speaking some other languages, right? You guys know that. You call to that IVR, you can only have a couple of options which are recorded by this company. That's the custom prompt. But what about the system prompt if you change the language, right? So take it easy. That's why I'm here. I'm just going to talk about this advanced IVR on the PCRIS system. And today, this new feature will help us to solve all of these issues. So anyway, I guess that's enough talk. I'm going to grab my mobile and let's just make a phone call. Uh, call Yaystar. That's a pretty good idea. Of course, we're going to enable this new feature. Let's see the difference. Okay. Thank you for calling Yaystar. Well, yeah, that's the IVR normally, right? Uh, thank you for calling. You just follow the instruction. Mm -hmm. And you guys can see right now it's the business hour, so not a problem. For sales information, yep. please press 1. Okay, that's for Protect the sales support. department. Please I'm just going to do it. Hello, this is Esther. How can I help you? Hey, how's it going? Uh, I'm calling you right now. It's just for collecting some information. So please just update me. Great. I will send you by email. Uh, sure, sure, sure. That's fine. Not a problem. Send me by email. Okay, cool. Thank you. Okay, bye. Yeah, so obviously it works, right? This is the business hour. We're going to go through the IVR to reach out sales department. Well, what if this is out of business hour? Let's see. It's midnight. Okay, well, let's call Yaystar and let's see what's going to happen. Thank you for calling Yaystar. Uh, same IVR. You will just ask me to press 1. So let's do the same thing. Please press 2. Please leave your message followed by pound key. You guys can hear it, right? <laughs> it's the different destination. Quite interesting, right? Yeah. So that example, I just show you guys how do we use the time condition, you know, for different times, of course. Uh, but of course, we can configure something else. Like I said, languages, you can also apply it for the IVR. So why don't we take a look on the computer? Uh, first of all, guys, make sure you got the new firmware, all right? So just upgrade your system and jump into the admin account. Now we go check on call features right over here where we can find the IVR. So check on that one. And uh, over here, let's see, I'm going to create a new IVR. So I will just go check on add. For all these parts, nothing special, keep it this way, skip it. And uh, something special, it's on the key press event. Hit that button and over here, you're going to see that blue one, which is advanced setting. Now, this is actually the key point. You click on that one, you will see this pop up. So on this pop up, we got uh, two options. You can, you can try to enable time condition uh, and of course language simultaneously. Both are okay. But something a little bit special is going to be the time condition. When you enable time condition, I think you got uh, two choices. It's up to you. So the first option we got here, it's going to be this one. Same time condition for all key presses. If I keep it this way, absolutely all of my key press are going to be the you know same thing. Follow the same time condition. So I will just need to choose the time. You know, you guys can see this one. Time-based mode. Three options. As you roll, you got a three, you know, time condition modes there. So pick one of them. Uh, let's make it simple. I'll use the first one based on global business hours. Then we click on confirm. So something special happens right now on your interface. It looks like this. So my example, like I said, if I press one, it goes through the IVR to reach out the sales department. Now, under the business hour, the destination is supposed to be maybe the rain group of our sales department like this. Uh, but obviously, like I displayed before, if this is out of business hour, the destination is supposed to be somewhere else. Well, I guess it's going to be the group voicemail. So we can just select group voicemail. Pretty easy. And for holiday destination, up to you, right? I would like to ignore the holiday destination because in my example, I never use it, right? And another thing very important here left, like I said before, we can also apply the language here as well. I got a couple of system prompts here. If I'm going to switch it from English to Chinese to something else, I'll just need to set it here. Pretty easy, right? Very user friendly. Uh, anyway, get back to the advanced setting. One more thing we can do here. It's about the, you know, time condition mode here. You got another option, which is 
custom the time condition for each key press. If I select the second one, I will be able to customize the time condition for each one of these keys. That will be super flexible. So pretty awesome, right? This is gonna be a very important update on your PCR system to get a better user experience. So that's how it looks, all right. Uh, anyway, guys, pretty awesome feature. Don't forget to get the new firmware for your system. Well, if you don't have a PC or system, that's fine. You know what? We provide you the trial license as you will check in the description. You can get the trial license as always. All right. Uh, so that's it. That was all we have for this one. Hope you guys like it. Don't forget to subscribe our channel and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Yeah.